Ladies, ladies, ladies. Tap in. Why do a lot of y'all females judge and criticize another female? Why do you think you why do you have the audacity to call another female ugly, bald headed, flat chested, no butt? Oh, she's too skinny. Oh, she's too fat. Why do we do that? And I'm going to say we because I used to do this. I'm not going to sit here and pretend I never did this in my life because when I had unhealed wounds and traumas and I was living that toxic life, I used to be very judgmental. And a lot of y'all have the audacity to sit there and call somebody bald headed or ugly but y'all wear over no pounds of makeup y'all wear wigs or extensions or tracks sometimes they're not, they're not even put together right y'all walking around with a diaper bar aka BBL, you know, plastic boobs, silicones, whatever, tummy tuck, fake nails, fake lashes, fake brows. But y'all be the main ones calling another female ugly or criticizing them or judging them. But your entire life is fake. Let me tell y'all why y'all do this. Lack of self-love, lack of confidence, lack of self-esteem, misery. Again, you have unhealed wounds and traumas. So you project how you feel about yourself onto another woman. Maybe somebody has nice real hair and you already hate your hair. So, whatever you, whatever painful, negative thoughts and words you speak about yourself, you are project, you project it onto another woman because you think that's gonna make you feel better. It's a very ugly thing to carry. It is not cute. It does not look good on you. I honestly see this a lot. And my thing is, for the females that got in any type of surgery, you obviously didn't love yourself. Because if you did, and if you had high confidence and high self-esteem, you wouldn't have gotten that BBL. You wouldn't have gotten your tummy tuck. You wouldn't have gotten your boobs done. You obviously was insecure or had low self-esteem or low confidence or lack of self-love because a person that fully 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 loves themselves within and know who they are within they wouldn't change anything about themselves except their surroundings their the way they eat the way maybe they want to dress better maybe they want to do their hair better but they still maintain the naturality that in which they were created in only a person that's insecure doesn't have enough love for themselves would would turn to surgery so instead of instead of sitting there calling someone ugly or bald headed or flat or whatever take a look at yourself some of y'all walking around with diaper looking asses aka bbls and or y'all get tons of surgery and y'all still look like a box of cereal y'all shouldn't be doing that it is not cute to tear another woman down. It is not cute. It just shows who you really are. It just shows that you have zero confidence, zero um, so low self-esteem. You have no love for yourself, no respect for yourself. You're literally projecting 
your wounds, your pain, your drama, the how you feel about yourself onto another woman because you think that's gonna make you feel, that's gonna make you feel better. And it's an ugly trait to carry. A lot of y'all social media, y'all don't look how those avatar pictures that y'all be putting. Y'all don't look like that in real life. Y'all got pounds of makeup on. Then y'all 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 have the audacity to throw on a filter. But y'all got the nerve to call another chick ugly or bald headed. Why don't you try walking around without any makeup, without any lashes? Why didn't you keep your natural body? No, you couldn't, right? Because you're, you're you didn't you didn't have enough love for yourself to stay natural. And you don't you're not gonna walk around without any makeup because you're insecure. So for, so remember that remember that remember these words before you try to judge or criticize another female before you try to um, tear down another woman because whether it's their appearance or whatever mind your business mind your business seriously and again your social media your avatar life that's not even you a lot of y'all live off filters that's a sign of insecurity and then you have a lot of pounds of makeup where you cannot live without makeup. That's insecurity. That's not that's not called having love for yourself. Because having love for yourself, there's no filters in here at all. This is me, the real me. There's no makeup. I don't wear makeup. Uh -uh. And if I ever put a filter in, my, in any of my videos, just to play around. But my default pictures on any social media is will be the real. Right now is dedicated to my daughter heaven but if I put me I put me think about that some of y'all females need to change that stop criticizing another female without looking at yourself because if you claim to have love for yourself no no you don't you still don't have love for yourself you got you love your outer appearance you love that fate the way that fake butt um, attracts attention you love the way the fake boobs attracts attention that's it. Be kind. Be loving. Uplift another queen, another goddess. Don't tear them down.